All right, back out here. February 10th. Oh. You know, they're still gonna be a little bit behind, but that's just how it is. So, all right, out of breath from the trip over here. Oh, need a second. All right, so, hoping, actually for once, hoping not to find a ton of stuff, because we got way too much crap. I say that, there's, I see multiple things. Um, we got plenty of crap at the house at the moment between scrap and resale, especially resale. I mean, I really don't need to be out here. I got a, an Amazon pallet to go through, so. Uh, try and keep it to the better stuff. So, like this stuff. Oh, I'm gonna open this dumpster here. Well, that's also good. That means nobody's came over here. Because the other guy, the local uh, dumpster diver influencer, we'll call him. Um, he was over here uh, in this general area earlier in the week. I seen his video. Uh, so he was in the area and I saw he checked fire. So, and of course, he didn't really get anything because there was nothing to find. So I think he came on like probably Monday, Tuesday, maybe Wednesday. And, uh, you know, fire was like freshly emptied. So, um, you know, it was not for him to find because that just been through Sunday and it looked like garbage had just came, uh, right before I, oh, there's, there's some stuff right here. I need to get the stick for it because it's like just out of reach. Some of it is anyways. Oh, just knock some more of it down. Um, let's see if I can get it with this. So, like I said, I'm hoping that uh, we didn't attract a bunch of locals to this area. Because where he went, it's um very obvious. To anyone who's local, could figure out where this is. So. And, uh, there's not enough scrap to go around in the... Uh, dumpsters in this little area so I don't want unnecessary competition so I don't need competition so I think we should be fine I say if not he if that roll up didn't get empty before he came here he probably would have got the uh floor cleaners Oh, did I even tell you guys that we came back for them? I did end up coming back for them. I think Monday, it was Monday night. Uh, it's just string that's kind of thin. Oh, it's a boy right there. That was kind of thin as far. Right in here. What is this? This wire? Looks like it. <sighs> oh, it's like thin crap. Yeah, it's like thin little stuff. But hey, it's still wire. It's still wire, so. I think it. See, any boxes over here? Boxes seem like they got something. Like a ship two box. That seems like it could have something in it. Ooh, there we go. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah, nice little steel rod. Nice oh, screws. All right. That's what I'm talking about. I probably don't want stuff in yet here. Right? Here we are having plenty of stuff to find. I mean, scrap. You know, just take the scrap here and be done with it. Contemplating getting another storage unit because we have too much crap for resale at the moment. 
Mm, nothing in that box. Nope. That feels like wire right there. <clears throat> Poke a little hole. No. Oh. Mm -hmm. No, that was not wire that I felt. <laughs> that was this. That's not a wire. Oh, nice and dusty. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's not it. Okay, no, actually, it's not. Anything in here? It's a bunch of junk. It's a dust. Another bag on the bottom. Uh, I'm not that worried about discovering it. In that. Ooh, this bag's heavy, though. Well, let's open the other lid. I can probably open the other lid. Close this other one. I need them both open. <sighs> Alright, kind of doing this the hard way. He's a chain. He's fall off the truck. I guess. Some also dusty. I'm gonna do it with my hair stick just. Damn it. Mm. No, that's just heavy, but I don't see anything. blade broke off. <clears throat> and it was just the wood. It must be. Because I don't see anything down there. Alright, well. Well, that's uh, good enough for me. Alright, we'll see what uh, everyone else has got. Alright, I clean our check that I'm sure nothing in it. I'm sure you also notice it's windy as hell out. So. Uh, no, it's still full. I think it's actually the same crap, just. Now they moved the, the pallet down and then took that empty space and filled it up. Okay, I can't tell if it's the same stuff or not. There's a dishwasher box. I know James says something about there's a dishwasher. <laughs> yeah. I can't tell if it's the same stuff or not. Oh well. Just a bunch of pallets. No floor cleaners today. Alright, we'll see what fire has. Check gutter. Um, and we'll be done. So I gotta go back to the other section at some point here. I haven't checked it in months. I don't even know what's over there anymore. I'm assuming that roll off is gone. You know, where we had all those scores. I mean, we've gone to storage since, but I just haven't said, hey, let's see if that roll off's still there. Or let's check the dumpsters back there. It's usually there's nothing in them, so I don't even. Um, so not going over there is not a big deal. So we'll see about going over there at some point i mean i do need to go to storage uh, i have an order i need to pull from there so i do need to go over there maybe we'll check to see if the roll is still there at least all right 
<clears throat> gutter, like I said, is probably still uh, not in it. So, let's see, let's see. Okay, let's open the top and look things out. That's what we normally do and go through the side. Alright. Wow, not much this week. This doesn't look much different than when he was here. Like there's some of the oil filters and the Tim Hortons cups and that. Ooh, is that over there? That was a light. Oh, there's one right here. Ooh, look at that. Look at the aluminum on this, man. Ooh. Let's go. box and this box nope yeah oh there's another one right there <clears throat> oh this one's not that I'm heavy oh this one is however this one not so much but damn this is nice extruded all right now right, let's look in the other door uh, yeah that's a nice one yeah, look at that. I assume there's like a transformer or something in the bottom. Alright. Let's get the other one that's over there. Oh, you missed out. You missed out, Dave. Alright, there's another one right here. Well, it's a smaller one. And not another box. Yeah, for normal. Um, there's trash, there's like nothing in here. What is this? It's a bunch of junk. Junk. Yeah, there ain't nothing in here this week. Well, I'll take these. These are ah, nice. Alright, well. Last week's dumpster dive. Quick and to the point. Yeah, there's nothing else over here. I'll take the bag of trash. Which I don't need to loot through, there's nothing in it. Hmm. I forgot. There's a bottle. And it's this generic um, code red. It's not even Mountain Dew code red. It's like Save a Lot brand. Um, should I do C? No, no, it's a full nope, cool box. Box for a little um, hand tool. All right, not too bad for not wanting too much stuff, so. All right, like I said, we'll check gutter. Um, probably nothing there, really, other than maybe like a few bottles and just random small pieces of gutter scrap. Not too worried about it. If there's anything, I'll show you. Other than that, we'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, we're out dumpster driving. I didn't think I would be, but we're out here. Um, it's not too bad out. Uh, I mean, everything's frozen over, but it's not like too windy. It's not snowing real bad. Ooh, good thing I decided to trek out here. So I decided to make the trek. Um, it's Monday night, President's, uh, President's Day. And, uh, decided to have a trek out here. That wasn't too bad out. It was... I still got some stuff in here from last week. Uh, almost didn't come out. Oh, but then I said, screw it. I want to at least hit, you know, this part. Maybe a little bit of the trash. Uh, but one neighbor's house I want to check out. There's some buckets. And there seems like there's some stuff. There might be some, or at least might be some. I wanted to check that out as well. Do that on my way back. Bungee cord. Doesn't look too bad. So, I came in the back way. You can probably see my tracks through there. They'll see them when they come in. Um, I did not want to go all the way around. It's, like I said, it's not too bad out, but I still don't want to be trekking around longer than I need to. So. All right. Okay, it's not looking as good as it, it did. The other side did at least. 
Um, I don't know what that is. Ooh, that's in there. All right, this GoPro might be whacking out because it's kind of cold out here, right? Like right now, things are upside down. They say they're red. I know it froze a second ago. Um, so we might not be filming too much here because the GoPro is going to whack out. Like if I give it a light smack, it just whacks out. So if the video randomly just like stops constantly, that's why. Because the, the GoPro is whacking out. So... Like on the screen right now, it's all, it looks whacked out. I won't know until I go to edit. But this is going to be whacked out footage or not, but. Let's see what we can do. Okay, let's go for a sec, guys. Not much I can do about it. I don't want to drop money in another GoPro. It was bad enough I already did. Nope. Yep. I want to buy my, buy another GoPro again. At least with the other one, it was still in the return window. And I just returned it to Amazon for the 10. Because that was crap. But this is uh, out of return date. Well out of return date, so. Let's not have to buy a new one. Oh, this thing's just whacking out. Yeah, this is going to just whack it out. Alright, I'm just going to show you what I'm done. This thing is just going to whack out. Uh, and we're only going to be able to record 30 seconds at a time here, so... Um, I'll kind of just have to show you the haul when we're done. All right, I could use my phone to show you this. GoPro just keeps whacking out. Um, so, um, the little bit of stuff you saw me get at door, that was pretty much it. There was nothing else at fire or cleaners. Fire was completely empty. Cleaners had a bag, so nothing else to be found. But I stopped at gutter and got loaded. These, these nice big sheets. These are aluminum. And all these other pieces. Bigger pieces of elbow mostly. That's what it is. And some bottles. And the next great thing was. The neighbors right there. Um, I seen these two buckets. And I knew I wanted to check them. Because it looked like there was probably good stuff in them. And there is. This one's got nice crap that James probably will want. And some other good stuff at the bottom. That's one bucket. The other one I shoved under the fence over here. Because it was heavy. I didn't want to carry it. All the way across. All the way up. So I kind of shoved it under the fence. Because this one, as you can see, is loaded. So. Ugh. Come here, bucket. Very heavy. So, I don't know, it might be just, uh, if anything, it's good weight. We do need to do a strap run, so, whatever James doesn't, oh, board. I see it's got, we have some better stuff in it. I gotta go through it a bit. But, uh, like I said, we need to do a scrap run. I need to figure out if we're gonna sell that or just scrap it. And I gotta go. These were still in the trailer from last week. I didn't even, haven't even touched them. So, luckily, I get this unloaded into the toter that's got the aluminum in it at the moment. And then go through those buckets. And, uh, might be some scrap from that, but I do want to, I think I can sell parts off of it. So, that, if anything, needs to go in the house. So, that's it for this week. I'm not going to go out running our streets. 
Um, I don't feel like it. It was enough of work. I'll get in this crap. So and that's uh, it for this week. Uh, next week, in theory, might be better. Um, but I might need to do it Friday because Saturday is supposed to get cold again. So we'll see.